بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله على محمد وآله الطيبين الطاهرين ولعنة الله على أعدائهم مجمعين من الآن إلى أبد العابدين Hope Without hope we cannot live equally and side by side as happy as everyone else on the face of this earth One day Prophet Isa, Prophet Jesus السلام, was walking when he saw an old man working tirelessly on his field, holding his spear and digging the earth. He sat down by a tree observing this old man and how hard he was working, with passion, with hope, as if he was going to live for another thousand years. Prophet Isa السلام, raised his hands and asked Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to take away hope from the heart of this man. Suddenly, moments later, he saw that old man throw his spade to earth and go and lie down under a tree. Then, Prophet Isa alayhi salam again raised his hands and asked Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, O oh Allah, would you give back hope to this old man? This man stood up picked up his spade and started continuing what he was doing before, digging the earth. Moments passed and Prophet Isa السلام, approached that old man and asked him, O oh, old man, I was observing you for some time. What made you throw your spade and leave what you was doing and you laid down on the earth? That old man said, My conscience. My heart spoke to me and said, O oh, old man, how long have you left on this life? Until when would you like to work? Then I threw my spade and went and laid down on the earth. Then my heart and my conscience spoke to me again. And this time it told me that you have a life to live. You have to make a living. I stood up and picked up that spade. What we learn from this story, brothers and sisters, is that without hope, as we understand from the traditions of the Holy Prophet, peace be upon him, is that if there was no hope, no mother would have fed their child, nor no farmer would have went out and farmed any trees. So here, life wouldn't go on. Life would not continue without hope. But then, there is good hope and there is bad hope. This poet in the Arabic language describes to us this hope that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants us to be conscious of because too much hope could lay us straight from the right path. Ya man bi dunya Oh the one that engaged in his worldly life and worldly desires. Qad gharrahu tool al-amal he thinks that this life that he is living will last forever. He will continue being in that dilemma until the last moments, until death arrives, he is still hoping that he can make a living. He is still hoping that he can stay amongst his life desires and lusts until the end. الموت يأتي بغتة Death arrives suddenly والقبر صندوق العمل The grave is a box is a chess box of all of your deeds in this life اصبر على أهوالها Be patient upon all of the trials and tribulations لا موت إلا بالأجل There is no death except by the time that Allah chooses to take us from this life. So let's learn from the lives of these great individuals. Hope is good, but what kind of hope we have to learn?